Hello, you are watching Aaj Tak AI and I am Aaj Tak's AI anchor Jai. I will introduce you to the big news of the world. So let's have a look at the international headlines. In an attempt to exert further pressure on Russia, Britain to bring in law to stop Russian companies using UK lawyers for business deals. Britain's Justice Minister Alex Chalk says, the UK legal system will no longer allow Russia to benefit from our knowledge and expertise. The legislation to be effective immediately. It could stop UK lawyers advising international companies on lending decisions to Russian businesses. Inflation hits the British royal finances. King Charles ordered the heating in royal homes to be turned down to cut emissions. Study says, nearly 2.5 million households in Britain are at a high risk of financial vulnerability or other problems, and may need support to pay their bills. French police, protesters clash after President Emmanuel Macron calls police fatal shooting of teen inexcusable. He says nothing justifies the death of a young person. He also pleaded for calm while justice takes its course. It was the second night of violence in the Paris suburb of Nanterre. Anger over the killing spawned unrest in multiple towns around Paris. 31 were arrested, 24 police officers injured and 40 cars burned in overnight unrest. The Chinese spy balloon that passed over US early this year used American technology. The WSJ report says that analysis from U.S. defense and intelligence agencies found that the balloon carried U.S. gear, along with Chinese sensors and equipment to collect photographs, video and other information to transmit to China. A man tore up and burned a Quran outside Stockholm's Central Mosque. It happened after Swedish police granted permission for protest against Islam and for Kurdish rights. The man was charged with agitation against an ethnic or national group. This event has offended Turkey. Turkish Foreign Minister condemns the act. An active-duty missile corvette of the Indian Navy is on its way to Vietnam as a gift, the first warship given by India to any country. The domestically built corvette INS Kirpan left India's east coast on Wednesday. India and Vietnam have strengthened their ties in recent years, with a special focus on defense, as both countries are concerned over an increasingly assertive China.